Okay, take two because OBS recorded at the wrong resolution. We're doing a review of, or a showing of my map that did not work. It's not working for Bon Bon B. Again, I'm gonna to have to be scrapping um, everything and starting over with all new mods. And so I will not be continuing this map um, unless somebody can actually get it, figure out how to make it working. But here is the one-click collection, um, some Network Extension 2 roads, because Network Extension 2 is definitely broken. A few trees, just three there, some Bon Bon B assets, uh, and some things that have been removed. This wall is no longer here in the map, um, and I don't know what else is no longer here. But the, there's some mods that were not working for, for Bon Bon B, and they're, I'm working on getting rid of them. So don't click the, this or this. There's things that are broken there. But let's go back into the game again, because I just spent 40 minutes recording a video that was crappy resolution. <laughs> 240 resolution and exported to and well that's not going to please anybody that's not going to be viewable so we do it again now I do not have a saved um, theme mix because I'm getting this error with theme mixer 2 but you can set things with, uh, as I stated, um, in the one-click collection. I'm going through the map editor so I can actually use the night. Uh, my night's not working for me uh, in in game, so I'm going over here. Uh, I forgot to get the um, zoom to camera or zoom to cursor mod. So this is once again going to be. A wonky flyover where it's going to go in place the camera is going to go places I don't want it to go <clears throat> let's just wait for this to load okay first things here we go we got this problem still just some uh, bullards that I haven't loaded in but they didn't show up in the loading screen mod report um, last time I checked in. So, ah, this map. Okay, first thing we got, well, ah, like I said, it's going to have some mouse errors, problems, because we don't have the right camera mods. So, biggest problem on the map, initial starting problem. Got this water issues, but I built this nice water containment facility here. So if we hit play and speed up, the water falls down. And it goes through the rocks, hits the flood wall, and funnels into the canal. Canals are kind of a feature on this map. We got the dams there, the reservoir, we got water, and each of these water pumps has their very own solar panels on the roof. Um, oh, right, in detail, the fence here to block off um, other people from going into the industrial area. Um, wanted to make a dirt road coming down here. Um, I said there's going to be mouse problems. Why the ruining is still going on here, I don't know. Um, Bo or find it, Bobby. Hide it, Bobby was supposed to, to take care of that. Uh, uh, let's see. So this side, the water just flows down here. But let's go actually do a proper tour of the map. Right? And down here, let's turn off the fog. And we'll start down here in the south. At the south end of the map. 
somehow where the uh, sewage deposit is. Train line going down the middle of the highway. Probably the ugliest intersection on the map. It's been cleaned up some. Yes, this is cleaned up. <laughs> so you can imagine how ugly it was before. Yes, come down over here to do our proper tour. We've got cargo hubs around and trains going through and around them. Key walls around them and ooh, the essential lighthouses. And yes, these are, come on, these are the essential lighthouses because they light up. Custom assets from the workshop, it's actual light. Back to the, this nice big old huge bridge. Big old bridge that's unfortunately currently very vanilla. That needs some something done to it. More lighthouses. Oh, let's look up the... where does this go? This goes to absolutely nowhere. Just the nice area. Nice roads. The, there should be... we got the everybody's favorite factory. With a big old key wall to keep the terrain nice and flat. Um, if you want to put a, uh, another cargo hub, you can there, but I don't think so. I didn't think so, I should say. Uh oh. I just. No oh, come on. Just noticed some bumping in the rails lines there. That's supposed to be smoothed out. Because I took the time to smooth out much of this these roads and the rails with the move it mod. Yeah, there's some more bumps over there. And here we've got some three lanes into four lanes into five lanes. Is that actually a bump? Ah, oh, it's a flat intersection. And into more lanes. Six lanes and then back down to three and three. Going off to this nicely detailed rocky area with rocks underneath the overpasses as I had wanted to do. Trying to figure out some nice designs for something, ways to hide that a little bit, which I've raised this node up recently to make this line a bit smoother, that slope smoother, which means the rocks are not quite accurate, not quite right. That's a bit wonky. Um, Got nice tunnels going around that intersection. Whoa, not what I wanted you to do. Then we got the lane markings. So I had put some walls under here, some rocks. There were rocks under here, but I got rid of them. I'm trying to put walls in or something, something a little more interesting. And here's nice. This is the vanilla clover leaf reworked, rebuilt with a roundabout underneath it to get everybody from one place to the other. <clears throat> uh -oh, let's see, we were coming up that road, so let's continue on up this way. There's the other dam. Yep, that's just a single dam. And there's a nice road here with some nice switchbacks, and this is all very smoothly done. A little steep over there, maybe. But not too bad, it's not a rail line. Spruce trees. And a little wonky there. Coming back over this way. Not very exciting, because it's just nice and smooth and clean and needs another hundred hours of work on this map. Uh, check out this rock work with, whoa, whoa, down, not up, down, nothing pick, poking through there, no lights poking through there, no rocks poking through there, uh, I didn't replace these with the, uh, sound barrier one lane road, off ramps, right, we, oh, down to another industrial road, with more rock work. And another cargo hub. 
Oh, hey, and this is the Start Square Cargo Hub. Let's take a look. Oh, is it? No, it is not. And it's not the Start Square Cargo Hub. I take that back. But, still. Look at that. Look at the sand work, the beach work. Again, another hundred hours needed. And this, uh, to keep the traffic not backing up quite so much. And back over here, let's... Uh, let's see. Go up that way. Yes, I think we come up this way. Nice and clean. No trees on the road because the trees have been cleared from the road and young trees have been planted to start coming back towards up closer to the road to make it look nice. Yes, these are all sound barrier roads, um, not placed with parallel road tool, um, unfortunately. So these have all been hand um, repositioned to a uh, line. And an ugly intersection here, but we're avoiding the pillars. Oops, I uh, haven't changed the lights on that road there. Um, this is another kind of ugly intersection, this turn there, that sharp turn. And that's the west end. Now let's continue on this way, down over here. Oh, the mouse problems. Road going underneath, more industrial, another tunnel. Lots of little trees next to the road. And we're back down at this intersection. We're gonna go on and continue on this way as we arrive in the actual start square, which is a strange intersection. There's not any, it's just a uh, highway connection. Um, not really an off ramp. And here's the Start Square um, cargo hub. Oh, hey, we got some more rock work over here. Uh, and we've got some missing pillars here because in trying to redesign things, make things look more uh, detailed and aesthetic, I removed them because I didn't like what I, I didn't like the walls that I had. Um, and those that removed the pillars same time because I also had rocks under here at one point. Going cleanly over the canal. The rail coming over the canal here. Some more crazy lane mathematics. And going up to Yeah, we'll swing up here. This canal overpass and to this partially designed intersection. Um Made in the asset creator and using and got the pillars going sideways there no pillars in the middle that was a challenge to get correct this is not quite lined up right anymore because I removed a node moved nodes on those but we've got actual usable off ramps and dark square type places should be no problems. Everything is actually high enough. And we've got one. Oh, that's a little wonky. And same thing over here. Yes, these were copied from one side to the other. But look at this uh, path coming down here. Yeah, I don't know. I think that's a great place to start building. And back over this way to the east side. So, did we come up this way? No. Of course. Where is this going to take us? This is going to take us over to the south. We've been to the south. Let's go over to the other east side. Is it another east side? Over a canal with a creek river that comes down from the glory hall through some rocks down and around and through rocking and holing that's not where I wanted to zoom 
because I don't have the zoom to cursor mod installed right now. But the edge of the canal is blocked off and hidden by the rocks. I think that's a good detail. A little bit of shark's tooth there. And we'll continue on. Little wonky. And over here we've got some tiered sections. Oh look, we got a crash truck pulling in. Whoop! Did you see that? Let's see if this one does it. Let's slow it down. Nope. He went on. Yep, and coming down to the cargo hub. See, the cargo hub... Oh wait, nope. He is going past. <laughs> well, sometimes they work. Uh oh. That is a problem right there. There. No more problem. Though these might be. Are these low? Those might be kind of low. That's around two speed. Let's go down to one speed. Oops, that intersection is not marked. Like I said, the map is not complete. But it's also not loading, not working, so... I gotta figure out, clean it all up completely so that it works. Uh, rail! It gets all over the place. And it bypasses... You know, where, did, where does it... Oh, we got this. So you got the rail line can go through here nice and cleanly, go over that way, or it can come down, go outside, go over to here, and this can come down here, this way, that way, any which way that is smoothest. Oh, down! This is not the smoothest intersection here, but it still works. Okay, so that's the major stuff. Let's go down into some of the details. We've got another creek coming out of a cave and a hole. Down into some rocky reservoir. And some animal spawn points. Those won't show in game, just in the map editor. Oh, and we got another creek up here. Oh, that with a drain into the glory hole. And it comes up, oh, that splits over here. And this is not supposed to be there. So that this becomes an eventual flood. And will flow out. And then you'll have to not zoom out, but deal with the water as it breaches this way and down there. That's something for you to do. Where does this water come from? Way up here in this cave that's kind of oddly placed and definitely needs a lot more rock work around it. But that's what you get for ancient eroded volcanoes, as this is. These, this is an ancient volcano island using the Shasta theme, because Mount Shasta is a volcano. And so the, vol the main parts of the volcano have eroded away, leaving just the volcanic plug. These places. Oh, and look, here we go. It, ooh, it's a castle. Very nice castle here. Um, the uh, entryway, I did mean to put another... Uh, broken wall up here to make that actually look a little bit better but if you look around properly oh there's a little bit of clipping in that side but overall 
no clipping in the towers and the doors are on the right spots or on the insides and we've got a lot of farms and food we've got food and paths and flowering trees and a statue to somebody the person who used to own this property this island fountain and inside the castle we've got another fountain with fire a burning fountain some magic explosion took place there and oh look we've got some trenches let's follow this trench around over to the helicopter pad and we'll come back over this way down let's take this one look, we got a split over here and move to a gunnery could use a little bit of a path there Get more to the gunneries trenches to the gunneries and oh look we got ourselves a giraffe and the trench is coming up to a tower that looks out over the world and oh hey look at this I see monstrosity oh the cursor That was a challenge to put together. It's not quite perfect, but it's protected for coming down to the lookouts and to the defenses, defensive locations. Fire at anybody coming out that way. Let's see, fire at people there. More cannons, lots of cannons. And. Oh, what is that? Some sort of bovine. Whoa, too far. Oh my. And we're back over here to this creek up here. Oh wait, I meant to show a few more castle bits. There's a, another castle bit over... Where is it? Here it is. We got trees. Apple trees and pear trees and food and there should be some pigs roaming around here somewhere so that I meant to put some supplies in and much much more things to make um, in all of these uh, areas so that they actually look like they're manned and uh, things that's kind of an odd intersection there trying to remember what I said the first time and what I haven't said this time is having to re-record this this probably might miss something oh I think we've taken a pretty good look let's oops come on oh, to the north the north the north the north two lighthouses there Some nice flowery tree island there more lighthouses and a nice big old island maybe a little too big for a bonbon island but uh, I think uh, this island is also a bit too big for a bonbon island but there's some rock work around here started that was certainly supposed to have an, a lot more done to it and a lot of animals a lot of wild animals alright let's see say we Let's take a look at the night first. Ooh, it's night. It's a beautiful map at night. All the essential lighthouses lighting up the edges of the island. Just, just a nice, pleasant nighttime view. Which, because I don't have the proper camera mods, I can't show the sky correctly. Oh, oh well. Let's look at the other important things here. But first, I'm going to pause the camera or restart. Okay. Now oh, let's look at water. We've got we've got pipes. There's definitely lots of pipes going around, and just because and this is the edge of the 25 tiles, so it doesn't show outside there even with common ground common ground doesn't fix the water well let's see 
water current. How's our current in the start square? That's a little bit. Flows out. And on the other side, the other canal, it flows out a little bit. But otherwise, outside of that, there's not much water flow. Just edge of map stagnation. Resources. I'm going to do some resources. They look like this, very painted, because you, after the initial use of the map, the first save, you lose the terrain generator that generates resources and trees automatically. Wind. We never look at the wind, but there's the wind. It's windy. And, well, let's, let's go over here first. Fishing, if you got Sunset Harbor and want to do some fishing, your fishing map looks a bit like this. There is no tuna, unfortunately. I tried really hard to get some tuna out here, but it just wouldn't work for me. Terrain Heights, it's a pretty flat map. A few bumps and the coastlines are a bit of a hill, a bit of a slope. But I think an experienced player can work through that and be okay with it. Okay, now let's look at the shipping. Shipping lanes, we've got them. They come into the cargo bays. I mean, just close. There, big old shipping triangle going off to the edge. And we got this one that goes, as another triangle goes off to the edge. It comes down here and ends just short of this cargo. And this is, act this is close enough to actually get cargo through. There's no cargo over here. Oh, let's go down this way. Oh, wait. Did we see all, all the cargo? No. Yes? I don't know. Let's make sure we see this one over here. Goes in. Comes down around. It's pretty simple, pretty basic. Pretty clean. Nothing's gonna go wrong. There's no bridges to go under. And... Yeah, I mean, assuming you don't uh, put in another cargo hub under here, shipping thing under here, because, well, I don't know, that might be high enough. Maybe? What do you think? No, I don't think a ship could fit through there. But that is... That. Oh, yeah, there's airplane routes, too. See, and they cut through here. It's a bit sharp turns. It's a uh, bow tie airplane intersections, I guess it would be. It works. This map needed 100 hours more on it. Definitely, definitely, definitely another 100 hours. Yes, there's the, car the essential cargo crash. Shipping crash nights to the essential lighthouse. <laughs> um, yeah. So I hope you liked the map. It definitely needed a lot more work. Another 100 hours to it, definitely. I've already spent like 150 on it. Close to that, at least. How's our booby trap coming along? Nice, pretty smoothly, pretty slowly. I don't think I want to sit here waiting for that to overflow. Is that I want to. Come back here down. Anyways, that is Butamus, the map that would not load. Or, and I'm going to be starting a new map, all fresh. And hopefully not breaking, not broken. Thank you for watching and viewing my broken map. Of course, I didn't save the changes that I just made. <laughs> so, and may the chaos of your existence be beneficial.